conservative new media viewers, what's going on? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the super genius, and I have an incredible science and nature story here. First of all, check this out. Apparently, there was a quote-unquote crop circle off the coast of Japan. And this was a very intricate, you know, I, I say quote-unquote crop circle because it actually wasn't plants or crops at all. It was a sand structure. Very intricate, very detailed. This thing was over six feet wide. Very interesting. It had all kinds of ridges and different things and structures. I'm going to put information in the description. You can check some stuff out. This is below the video. You can see in the video description. Now, this quote-unquote mystery has actually been solved. I'm going to tell you about that in a second, but you may ask yourself, JDV, what formed this sand structure, this quote-unquote, you know, crop circle off the coast of Japan? Was it aliens? Was it a human being playing a prank? No, actually, it turns out, apparently, that it was a puffer fish. A single male puffer fish made this very intricate um, structure, if you will, sand structure, all kinds of ridges. There were some shells in there. There were some different things. I guess what happened here, first of all, my personal opinion only, not like any facts, not cast any aspersion, all for entertainment purpose only. Please check the disclaimers. Apparently what happened here is that this puffer fish, you know, uh, you know, put a good bit amount of effort into making this structure. These structures are made by the male puffer fish to attract female puffer fish because when you have this kind of structure, it gives more protection when the female lays her eggs. So it kind of, you know, sort of acts as a, I, in my personal opinion, a breaker, if you will, for some of the currents and stuff like that to kind of keep the eggs in place. And I think the shells down there might even provide some kind of sustenance and stuff for uh, the, the little hatchlings and stuff. So it's very, very interesting uh, that, you know, that, that they were able to find out what made this. And this puffer fish, that, you know, props this puffer fish. It's really cool. I mean, for one little puffer fish to make that kind of structure and work that hard, I gotta give props to that puffer fish. So it seems like this quote unquote crop circle mystery, this Japanese quote unquote crop circle mystery has been solved. Turns out that it's a puffer fish. Nature again shows how unbelievable it is and how fascinating. There's so many things out there that we still don't know, but we're learning more and more as we go here. You know that I love the science stuff. You know that I love the, the, the animal stuff. This combines it. We've got nature. We've got science. It's all coming together. What do you think about this? What do you think about this hardworking puffer fish? Tell me where you're at on this. Give me the comments below. Please subscribe up. I'm John D. Valero, the four-time national champion and the super genius. You're watching conservative media. Please rate this video up. Also, please post it to your social networking sites. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.